what's good youtube it's your boy fresh cuts and right now i'm doing my fur coat collection um one by one i give you the details and everything that i like about it everything that i don't like about it and yeah without further ado let's just get right off into it guys all right starting off with the white mink coat shoulder set hanger it's in decent condition um i just have to get the right arm stitched up and I think underneath the armpit on the left hand side and the rip right here. But besides that, the per the coat is in pretty good condition. All right, you guys, this is the white mink coat. And you can see the rip really noticeable right here on the right hand side and also on the left hand side. You know, once I fix those rips, this coat will be pretty good condition, if you ask me. The arm length could be a little bit longer, but, you know, it is what it is. Nice white mink. Full length. I got the black tights with the fly net trainers, you know, just for the sake of the video. Um, I love the pockets, first and foremost. The pockets on this is just nice and deep. Look how much space it is in there. Yes, sir. So the the pockets is a winner. I just have to fix the rips within this uh, winter time, possibly. Let me give you a back side real quick. Yeah, I love this coat, man. You know, it's been around for a long time. Um, I love the collar on it. It's very good condition. You know, just got to fix the rips. And once I do that, you know, this coat will pretty much be... Not new, but it'll look really refreshing and everything. Give it a whole brand new look to it. Um, I love this white mink for real, man. It's just so classy. You can dress it up. This is more so of a dress up type of thing. Um, all white or maybe even all black with it will do the job just right. So that's the white mink coat. On to the next. And on the second mink coat. We got the, believe it or not, this is actually brown. Brown Zimmon furs, very popular on the East Coast. Shout out to Camden, New Jersey. But yeah, the long length brown mink coat. Let's try this bad boy on. All right, you guys, this is the dark brown mink coat. Zimmon furs, Zimmon furs, been doing their thing for a while. You know, this is the long length. Again, the arm length is pretty short, but I'm used to that um man this is very comfortable not too heavy it's not the warmest and the pockets are eh they could be a little bit deeper it's not as deep as the white mink but uh you know i think the all black just it just sets the mood is very classy but it's extremely comfortable you guys and you know it, it's it's pretty much standard you know it's not going to stand out like the rest of the mink coats and the fur coats but you know, it's a good switch up. It's a good switch up with everything that you have. The collar kind of looks like it has a hood to it, but it doesn't. You know, and that's, uh, I guess that's just the styling of it. Zim and Fur has been around for decades. And, you know, they, <laughs> this coat, man, no complaints about this coat whatsoever. No rips, no nothing. It's been around for a long time and kept up with it. You know, good to dress down. It, it just gives off that boss mafia feel. It's the back. Nice. So, that's how it is with the Zimmon furs. Dark brown, but it could pass for a black, I guess. And I almost forgot to show you guys the floral design on the inside of the dark brown mink from Zimmon Furs. Very nice stitching, attention to details. It's on 100% and it also comes with this Zimmon Furs bag as well. And you, you guys already seen the hanger, but just look at that details, amazing. And on the third coat, we have Contemporary Furs, the Blue Fox short length check out the insides on that it's like a beige colorway champagne 
Let's try this bad boy on. All right, as you see, I have the blue fox short length. And this is very different from the rest of my fur coats because this is short length. And also the arm length is still long, but I'm not going to lie, you guys, this this is very comfortable. You know, I get tons of compliments every time I wear this. And, um, you know, it just feel it just feel rich. It just feels so elegant, you know, um, I, I, I don't know how to explain it to you guys, man, but. Every time I wear this coat, I just feel like, I don't know, I just feel like grabbing the baddest girl you see at the mall when you wear this. You know, it's just so smooth. It's just like, no, I don't want to listen to what you got to say because I'm better. You know, it just screams I'm better. Let me just show you guys the back. No rips, no tears. It's another reason why I love this coat. This coat is always the go-to out of all the coats I have because it's not too heavy, but it does keep you warm. Um, the pockets is not as deep, but I mean, on a coat like this, does it really have to be? Um, yeah, you guys, this, this, I, I usually wear bummy stuff with this because one thing about fur coats, you don't really have to do too much. You can do less, you know, white white t-shirt some jeans air force ones will do with this um you don't have to do too much it's just very smooth it just sets the tone every time i wear this i just feel rich and you know this is my favorite one out of all of them um this is my second favorite um this is the third coat the blue fox let's go into the next one and on the fourth one we have the golden island fox long length with uh i guess a cashew brown inside interesting let's try this bad boy on now i'm not gonna lie to you guys this has to be the third best fur coat in my collection you know i don't care what else you say about everything else but this has to be in your top three of my collection this golden island fox is amazing um you know, I need to brush it off a little bit. You know, it's been hanging up in the closet a little bit. You know, should shake it off, let it, let the hair just naturally hang down, you know, so it gets back to its normal shape. But it still looks good regardless, you know. I don't even think you guys could even, like, pick up on what I'm saying with the uh, fur coats, you know. Like, if you have this in your closet long enough, the fur coats will be a little bit raggedy. But um, regardless, I love this coat, man. The Golden Island Fox just looks so rich every time you wear it. Is I feel like all white with this would do the trick. Um, but I also wear all black with it too. Um, the Golden Island Fox is just amazing. It's the pockets. The pockets are standard. It's all right. Um, the arm length is actually all right. I like the arm length like this. Um, shows off the bracelets and everything let me show you guys what it looked like from the back yep no rips no tears taking very good care of this coat um this coat just screams elegance too just like the blue fox but also that golden island fox you just can't do wrong with it baby you can't do wrong with it like i said you know i'm gonna have it outside the closet because it, it was hanging up for a long time in the closet and, you know, on top of other clothes and everything. So I need to make sure that it gets back to its actual shape. You know, shake it off a little bit. Let it hang up somewhere else. And, yeah, you know, this, this coat is just it's something else. Definitely something else. You know, I remember going into the mall and seeing this lady come up to me like, oh, that's definitely real. <laughs> what, what, what else I have to say about it, man? This is the fourth coat. Golden Island Fox. Yes, sir. All right, you guys, on the fifth coat, we have the Nicholson Furs on the inside. Look at that beautiful, beautiful champagne stitching with the flowers on it. Um, we do need to fix this rip right here. Um, is there a rip on the other side? No rips on the other side, just that part. Um, but yeah, let's try this bad boy on. Yeah, that part, you can see the little 
rip on the back but it's not ripped on this side which is very surprising but i really like this collar this collar pretty much prevent uh cold air from coming in i, I really like that i really like that style um yeah guys look at that look at the arm length pretty good arm length right long length yes and actually when you put this coat on it, it overlaps naturally i don't know what they did to do that but that's pretty cool with the champagne inside embroidery i love the embroidery it just sucks that you know it has that big uh that big gap show you one more time you know you can see my whole shoulder um but besides that i'll get it fixed you know in the winter time but besides that i love this coat too just wearing it again just reminds me of how much i really like this coat um it's very rich i don't know what kind of fox it is you guys i, I forgot you know i can't keep up with all these coats but it's definitely real um shout out to nicholson's first got this out in jersey what you guys think and on my six coat this is my favorite you got the brown coyote with the chestnut brown interior long length this is this is the best one i got you guys i can't wait to put this on to show you guys so let's put it on now do i even need to say it do i even need to say it guys this is the coyote long length look at the arm length perfect the pockets perfect pockets are nice and heavy deep pockets man I don't, I don't even have to say much i love this coat i remember the day i bought this coat i was like man you know this was my first fur coat that was real i remember i went to nordstrom in uh king of prussia mall and i was wearing this i was burning up but i wanted to look cool right because this coat is extremely hot guys like I don't even like wearing this coat sometimes because it'd be so warm, but it, it just looks so boss and so badass. I was just like, man, like I have to wear this coat. So I wore this coat to Nordstrom. This girl walked up to me, didn't even know her, just start rubbing my coat. She's like, oh, this is Coyote, isn't it? And I was like, yeah, it's Coyote. Was good, baby. <laughs> oh, <laughs> now that's the wolf. I'm crazy, but no, seriously, guys. Um, this coat is just amazing. You have to see it in person. These videos kind of don't do it justice. Um, man, this coat is the one. Every time I wear this, is it's just I love the collar on it. The collar just looks so full. It's so long, you know, and and and. You know, it's just one of those coats where you don't really have to do much, neither. It don't matter what you wear for the pants. You know, you guys probably like, why are you wearing them skinny pants? It's just for the video. But you can't even tell what kind of pants I'm wearing. You can't even tell. It don't even matter what I'm wearing under here. I could be wearing some ball shorts, tank top. You wouldn't even know. You wouldn't even know. It's like a blanket. Um, Let me get a back view for you guys. Let's just look at that. Just look at that. This is my number one, guys. If I if I want to come to the party and just, you know, swag it out, this is what I put on. I, I wore this to the party, and man, I don't even want to. I don't even have to say too much. I don't even say too much, guys. You already know. This one, this is the one. Let me know down below in the comment section if you guys are feeling this coat as much as I am. Or do you like the other coats better? Me, this is number one. This is hands down. This is by far. I don't even have to say too much, man. Go to the next one. All right, you guys. And this is the last fur coat. This is Murrow's first. We have the blue fox with the pink insides. And let me show you guys what's up. Blue Fox, natural blue fox. Yes, sir. Got the tags on there. Made in Hong Kong. It's a size medium. 
Yes, sir. So, shout out to Miro's first. We're going to try this bad boy on. Let me show you guys what's up. All right, you guys. This is the last fur coat. Not going to lie. It's going to take a little bit of digging i gotta find out exactly what to wear with this one to make this my favorite like the rest of them but i like this pattern this down row pattern that it has you know very very different from the rest of the coats i had and i you know i wanted to challenge myself to see what i was going to wear with it it's not doing a lot you know it's not really doing too much you know, you're pretty much in your own lane, but it's still smooth, still player like. Uh, the pockets are decent, um, as the salmon pink, just like the interior of it. So I think that's a pretty good touch. Um, but yeah, you guys, this is the last fur coat. Let me know what you guys think. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. Do you like any of the coats? Do you feel like any of the coats? uh you don't like definitely let me know we can have a debate about which one is the best and which one is the worst let me know what you guys think like comment and subscribe and i holla at y'all see you on the next coat review